Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's room 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? <sighs> Let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Municipal garage. Bowery and Grand. Not a problem. I don't care if I lose everything else. But I have to find my Spidey drive. Can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30-ton garbage truck. I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. Of course it's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage. Maybe there's another way in. breaking and entering if I don't break anything, right? Okay, no need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure, I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great, I'm headed there now. But sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off. Really? I'll check out the pizza shops. Any idea which one? One of the mom and pop joints, I think. Jerry's? No, that's uptown. I mean, original Jerry's. Oh, right. No, started with an L, I think. Larry's? That's on the east side. Uh, wait, I think I see the trucks. Thanks, Eddie. Should be some trucks close by. Nope, stuff's not here. There has to be another truck around here. Down the block. Visit. How could it hurt you? Turn this way. No sign of my stuff. <laughs> what an interesting smell. Eddie, you're my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes due to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by Manhattan Bridge. Better hustle. There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. Uh-oh, looks like trouble.
You okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. I think that's it. Please be here, please be here. Yes! Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey, look. An old gadget prototype. Looks kind of awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? Huh, I think I can make this work. Got it. Look, it's that guy who fixes Spider-Man. Uh-oh. Ice him! Okay, well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ's. All right, how am I gonna talk my... onto MJ's couch. Let's see. Uh, hi, MJ. It's Peter. Any chance I could stay over to... Oh, that's too far. MJ! I was just in the neighborhood and... Oh, that's lame. Hey, MJ. Now that we're talking again, I thought maybe... I... Okay, that just sounds pathetic. Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Oh, what am I thinking? Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Hmm. Someone left me a voicemail. Number's blocked, though. Hey there, spider. Long time no see. Miss me? Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh-oh. I think I know that voice.
We've got an armed robbery in progress. Location is north of Houston. Over. who just literally destroyed a bank. Wait, you think I'm talking about Herman Schultz? Oh, no. I meant Spider-Man. Look, Schultz is a career criminal. Obviously disturbed. I mean, he calls himself the Shocker. So I don't expect him to act like a sane person. But Spider-Man claims to be a hero. Well, tell that to the bank employees who are out of a job. The customers who had irreplaceable family heirlooms in the safe deposit boxes. Couldn't he have waited? cellular network was vulnerable to terrorist attacks, so I set this up to monitor it. Can you do me a favor? Look for anything suspicious. Uh-oh. It's not terrorists, but there's a glitch in the system that's causing interference. And if I don't fix it, it'll bring the whole network down. Right now, it's only affecting the most sensitive equipment, like mine. I need to stay outside the areas of interference while I fix the cell towers. There. I set my lenses to show me the danger zones. Gotta fix the cell towers before the whole city's comms go down. The size of the problem area... Ah, that's the downside of all the tech in my mask. That hurt. Need to fix three more to solve the problem. Bet I can use those helicopters to swing. So much depends on cellular networks now. A crash would affect police, hospitals. It'd be as bad as a blackout. Gotta hurry. Soon the whole system's gonna go. <sighs> Felt like my eardrums were gonna burst. Got it. The job's only halfway done. Oh man, I wish there was a way to fix this for everyone except people who use their phones in movie theaters. The problem's getting worse. I'm running out of time. Invisible walls closing in. I feel like a mime! That one fixed. Bought me some time, but I can't slow down. Can't waste a second. Getting to be a tight squeeze. Okay, let's not do that again. Now New Yorkers can share their domestic disputes on the subway again. And emergency services are safe, which is, you know, also important. If the network had crashed, it would have cost Oscorp a bundle to fix their comms. They'll want to keep this station up and running. Harry's project should be safe.
Love New York. The de demons, though, seems like they just want to tear the city down. Good one. Don't mention it, officer. Friends, I've just received an update on Adrian Toomes, aka the Vulture. Apparently, this winged criminal has fallen ill with cancer, and he's been moved to the RAF's infirmary for treatment, which will undoubtedly cost a fortune in public funds. Now, let me ask you. Active. In Park City, over. Hard to hard time. 
you're not loved enough as Demon Babies, Dad's who withholding, Mom not around, let you cry all night. <laughs> <laughs> This is one of Mom's earliest projects. We were trying to develop a bacteria that would dissolve all the plastic in the oceans. But we, um... Well, she ran out of time. Look, if you have any ideas, it would really mean a lot. Hmm. With some genetic tweaking, I might be able to crack it. But I need a better equipped lab. And the bacteria only lives in liquid environments. Wait, my web fluid. I can keep the bacteria alive in my web cartridge. Yes, you should have the chemicals I need to increase its power. Oh man, the bacteria dissolved my web. It's in the cartridge for the webs I swing from. The other kind should be okay. Now I have to get to ESU without swinging from anything. If we don't exceed this, <sighs> the zipline webs seem fine. Hey, wow. Your taxes? I know. I'm just, well, I'm getting a heck of a workout. I gotta hustle. I don't know how long this bacteria stays viable. This is good practice for if my web shooters ever malfunction. You'd think these people never saw a guy jogging on walls. By law, they have to dispose of their chemicals in these containers. Should be some stuff I can use. All set. Now I have to get to Dr. Octavius' lab to combine everything. I'd just take the subway, but the bacteria won't survive that long. Okay, now I just need to grab the bonding agent. Peter. Oh, Peter. Don't even know why I'm bothering to record this. 
Norman has neutered us, and soon the lab will be out of funds. We were on the verge of such great things. And now the industrial centrifuge that'll get the bacteria out of my web fluid so I can store it properly. Just need to isolate the bacteria. Beautiful. I think I improved the bacteria. But I can only tell for sure back at Harry's research station. Peter. Oh, Peter. Don't even know why I'm bothering. Today's the day. Grant review. We're ready. Damn it! Why do I keep repeating the same mistake over and over? Our first volunteer subject, Lance Corporal Texador. Lost his arm overseas and now just wants to hug his daughter again. controller for the micro cables Doc's been theorizing. These things are awesome. So much more versatile than traditional fixed axis designs. Simple AI that'll improve the prosthetics functionality over time. Welcome to the future.
prosthetic has a tiny brain. Cool. And a little creepy. Doc dove right in with the intracranial interface. But not a hundred percent stable. We need to refine this design. Should have my web swinging back. Let's see. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, sweet web swinging. I'll never take you for granted again. I hope this works. I remember when Harry's mom started the project. 
meant so much to them both. Where there's a web, there's a way. There's the testing receptacle, full of plastic. Let's see what happens. It's working. Not as fast as I'd hoped, but better than before. Probably needs further testing. It didn't get all the plastic, but it's a big step forward. Enough for Oscorp to keep working on it. They'd win the Nobel Prize. And it wouldn't hurt their stock price either. 